fuck. But we're gonna try if I can do this. Look, hella vibes. Still. Still. I may have five minutes to fucking sit down and make another one. So let's try without fucking crying this time when I'm mad. I release the tears. Now I uh, move towards madness now. Destruction. Aloha came up in reverse, not having the patience for yourself, for others, not being calm, obviously, this energy right here. I don't know, maybe you feel like something's in your fucking way. Yeah. Trying to weigh out your options, trying to balance shit out, also trying to find a way to balance work, the household, and whatever the fuck else. While everything around her is kind of chaotic. Six of Cups. I'm gonna be gifted with something. You're also remembering and reminiscing some about something, about someone you could be reuniting. But you're still a little bruised. You just got out of battle. But the battle is where the abundance lies. Still in that gold mining energy, yeah? that digging deep within to find that gold so you can see that within yourself. Yeah, so you can love yourself unconditionally and not seek it externally. Sometimes motherfuckers don't know. Do you know? That's so why sometimes you get put in that situation. The spirit wants to see if you know. So really loving yourself because you are hurting, you are feeling unloved, you are feeling abandoned. Also, this speaks of regret. Maybe you're regretting that you put so much energy into something or someone and you felt that it was a wise investment. But there was a lot of challenges and obstacles, a lot of competition, butting heads. Could have been with your boss or a partner, yeah, and it was leaving you stuck, feeling left out in the cold, feeling broke, barely making ends meet, you know? That's what I'm fucking dealing with right now, trying to make ends meet, trying to bring money into the household, and it's just not fucking working out somehow, because I'm still a mom, you know? But if there's two parents in the home that's not working, then and somebody actually wants to, then why not, you yeah? know? But I have to balance being a fucking mother. So I have to, you have to, if you're in that same situation, feeling worried, barely having enough money, you know, then you have to be open to help. Yeah? Because there's some things that we can't do on our own. We have to be open to accepting help. But somebody also has a hard time deciding whether they want help. change so possibly somebody went through a tower moment or you know a lot of shit shifted in their life and it's making them change their perspective to say yeah i think i do need fucking help i think it's time to join forces now i'm gonna see this to join forces with people who are overcoming these obstacles and battles That's a blessing because then you get one extra one from the divines. That's a blessing. This is divine intervention, yeah? It's a blessing in disguise, those tower moments. Things falling out of place so they can fall into place, creating on a firm foundation. Victory, recognition, success, awards, being awarded. 
Self-recognition. Self-recognition. Ooh, in twos. Self-recognition. Then we got the Son of Swords. Now that you recognize yourself, you see that abundance within you. It's saying not to rush in. Not to get so big-headed, I guess you could say. Because you just came out of a bunch of obstacles and challenges as well. So you don't want to rush into this partnership. Because you're just... Or you've been clearing out cycles, but with this Chiron in retrograde, the wounded healer, healer, it's bringing up a lot of shit. Yeah, a lot of shit, showing you where things were built on faulty foundations. Where in spaces it lacked the Two of Cups energy. The divine partnerships. Yeah, this, this love and this friendships... very unstable so you're moving away from that moving away from rushing into things also walking away from making a choice because you have your sights set super high on being in a space where what you give is reciprocated and knowing, you know, now that you're going to be tapping into that supreme energy. Yeah, it's going to be different now. You're going to see it differently. What goes around comes around. Working together. A lot of working together. A lot of making clear decisions. A lot of new opportunities, new ideas, new energies. Yeah, we shouldn't be handling it the same way we're used to if we're new. If we're rewriting this story, yeah, you have to just completely burn the old book. If we're rewriting this new story, why are we going to put in old chapters? You're stepping into the supreme energy, the master manifester. So make sure you know what you're writing in your books. Make sure you're not letting anybody rip out pages or add pages in and put things in your mouth. I was feeling really cute as fuck this morning. I don't know if anybody saw my video on YouTube, but I was like a big ass baby. I was feeling cute as fuck. And now I just feel like shit. I feel like shit. But whatever I went through, me me explaining the need to work, it could have went differently. But you know what? I like to speak my truth. I like to speak how I feel because what comes from not speaking your fucking mind? I don't fucking know. I don't know. <laughs> so somebody's watching stalking spying watching you rewrite this story probably trying to see if they still have a chapter in your book and you look like you're moving forward and leaving everything behind because she's hurt but she also sees growth and potential and lust in someone He's also seeing the growth and pot potential in you. Two of Swords. Mm. Wow. Mm, cool, that's what we did this morning, yo. Two swords, blindfolded, I don't know. This, making a choice, blocking it out. Somebody's feeling something, but they're blocking it out. 
Age of Pentacles coming to offer their time and energy. So this one, this one may have just wanted to offer some sex. Yeah, he's holding his wand. Maybe that's what the spy was. They were watching you online holding their wands. And that's probably why you were you were blocking it out because you knew. <clears throat> because when you value yourself, you know who truly values you and who doesn't, yeah, who actually wants to offer their time and energy, not just their dick. What's off the table? Ooh, the obstacles. Off the fucking table. No more obstacles, no more challenges, no more competing. Oh, you, now that you block that out, nobody has to compete for your time. Oh, god damn, no more competing. And here comes my fucking Knight of Wands going at it with the Page of Pentacles. Oh, okay, so that was off the table. This in reverse is off the table. Somebody's like, I'm not standing for it. So the Page of Wands came in, armored up, suited up, ready. He said, I don't care if you're blocking out the challenges and obstacles, I'm still going to come through. Oh, damn. So maybe this lusty energy might might have been thinking that this was what all you wanted. They're like, no, 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 boo. I'm suited up for war. I came to help you. And the Ten of Cups, happy family, love, contentment, because he was suited up. Yeah, he came in as a page, and then he got suited up. He got ready. Yeah, we got the King of Wands. And then when this partnership comes together, that Ten of Cups, he turns into the fucking king. Wow amazing page of cups in reverse Seduction, deception, yikes. Happy family. Okay, what came out after that? Seduction, deception. Seduction and deception, page of cups in reverse. Yikes. So maybe that's on his mind because it was one of the patterns that they went through. And they're not having it. They're not accepting those emotions, yeah? They're not going to accept those emotions no longer. Yeah, this was in reverse. No longer stuck in the head. It's like, yeah, they could think that way, but they're choosing not to. I can't wait to come on here with my hair and like look cute and feel cute. King of Swords, open heart surgery. The King of Swords is coming in um, with his Oh yeah, to cut that shit out. Yeah, to cut to cut that deception deception seduction energy off restoring the hearts beautiful i'm gonna end it so i can post this one on instagram let's connect to our breath real quick <sighs> love y'all